Who's this gentleman? Right. Just general counsel, and there's nothing on the courts. I'm just messing it. Okay. Of general um, knowledge. That's okay. Um, you've got a number of charges here. I think um, do you need a lawyer. Do you want a lawyer? Um, actually, um, who are you? And I'm the prosecutor. Okay. And this is a pre-trial. It's not a trial. It's just an opportunity to. Uh, set this for hearing and see if you need okay, a Okay, now this name is a trust name that has been filed in UCC1, so any charges will be committing fraud upon that trust. Okay. So I'd like to move the court now to dismiss all charges. Okay, I'm not the court. Okay, okay. I'm just the prosecutor. All I do is set this for a pre-trial. It's not a trial. There's no judge here today. Right. All I need to know, first of all, is are you going to have a lawyer? And if you can't afford one, the court will appoint one for you. Uh, no, I will present myself. Are you going to represent yourself? No, I'm already present. You cannot represent somebody that's already here. All right. You're not going to represent yourself as an attorney, though, in the court? N uh, no, I will be speaking for myself. Okay. I'm not a ward of the state. All right. You don't want an attorney to be appointed to you? No. Okay. Not at all. All right. Um, and those those citations have been refused for cause. The officer wrote it in his own handwriting. So, I mean, if you want to just go ahead and... Whatever you want to do with them, get rid of them, let's get this over with, that would be great. Well, I, I don't have a problem. I mean, I'm not the judge. Right. Okay, so. So what are you seeking out of this? Set a trial date, set a hearing date, um, see if you need a lawyer. If you want a lawyer, the court would appoint one, no. decline counsel, uh, and then I'll speak to the judge and set a trial date, set a hearing date, talk to the officers. Um, and you're charged with speeding. Um, and some other actually minor offenses. Yes. Are you employed, sir? No, I'm not employed. I'm not a state agent or officer. And Jamie, are you a, a friend? Um, yes, what? I'm just a friend. Okay. Yeah, I, would, I won't be addressing the courts or anything like that. I'm just here to witness. He's part of my jury of my peers. The uh, actual, the um, resisting arrest and the um, obstructing is the ones that have been refused for cause on the tickets. So they're, he voided them himself. Um, they haven't been voided. They're still pending. Because um, there is no injured party here. And I'm not dealing with your maritime admiralty courts. So the only, you know, the only offense here that's, you've got a speeding ticket, <clears throat> which is generally, generally like a $50 fine. Right, I, I could not pay any fines anyway because House Joint Resolution says you cannot pay a debt with a debt instrument. So I can discharge them through the Treasury by accepting them for value if you'd like, and I can do that right now. You can pay them to the Treasury by issuing currency in the United States, too. Right, but I'd rather just do it with a bill so, of exchange. <clears throat> That's up to, I mean, I don't think the judge is going to let you do that. I don't think they're well, going to do that. But anyway, you've got a speeding ticket, which is not very significant. You've got mm -hmm. a seatbelt, which, I don't know, maybe you have a seatbelt or not. The only other two, and then you've got an, an OVI, which is operating the vehicle under the influence of alcohol, or drugs, and I'm not sure. I gotta talk to the officer and find out the basis. Yeah, he didn't even ask me for any so ill sobriety test. Didn't ask yeah. me if I wanted to take a breathalyzer or anything. So that and then was we've just got the obstructing official business and resisting arrest. Um, do you have a record anyplace else? Like, have you been arrested? Uh, again, that's my tr that's a trust name. I'm a flesh and blood sentient being. Okay. All right. I think what we're gonna do is just set this for a hearing. Okay. Okay. Although I may well. Can we do it sometime in October? We, What's your schedule like? Well, my schedule is pretty flexible, quite frankly, on these. They move rather quickly. October's a little bit of lengthy time. Why October, Mr. Warren? Why not? Well, because it's Just so long. I can get all my ducks in a row. Well, how about maybe within 30 days? I can do it in 30, 30 days. Okay. If not, I can get another continuance, I'm sure. Um, so here's what we're going to do. I'm going to we'll, we'll ask the court to extend this 30 days and give you a trial date, maybe 30 days from today, roughly, sometime okay. later in September. 
uh, I may schedule this for another pretrial if we get you the same address. You're going to be at the same address, and so I forth. don't have an address. I'm not a re I'm not a resident. How did we get a hold of you to tell you to be here today? Uh, they gave me the jail told me when I bonded out that I had to be here, and I called down here to see if the trust name was on the docket. Okay. So if I ask you to be here in 30 days from today on another Tuesday, can you do that? Sure. Okay. Uh, I'll have the uh, clerk. I'll give you a little. I'll give you the exact date. We'll see what that date's going to be. Um, <clears throat> and then I'm going to talk to the State Patrol about the incident um, and decide how I might handle some of these offenses. Okay. Um, and generally... I mean, would you like to read my trust uh, sure. verification here filed with the, the Secretary of State? Oftentimes, these things get worked out with no trial simply because we're hearing it because they're not always that significant. Most right. of the time, things get worked out. And people go about their lives, and we'll get back to people living their lives. Right, yeah. Um, and obviously, if I could do that in this case, I would do that as well. But <clears throat> but that requires give and take. It requires me saying, okay, you know what? Some of these I'm going to get rid of. Like some of these cases, yeah, I'm going to get rid of. And on the other hand, you're going to have to say, yeah, well, some I, of these I would, I would like probably, speeding. I would probably go ahead and do the speeding, but everything else, maybe the seatbelt. I don't recall if I had it on or not, and I'm not going to, you know perjure myself or, you know, provide false witness or right. all that stuff. You don't want you to. Um, yeah, so I think I've got to look at this and think. I've got to talk to the officers about some of the other evidence they, they have for some of these. And right. I might just, you and know, uh, you when you do talk to the uh, complaining officer, tell him I'd like my pocket knife back that he has. Okay. Like pocket knife. Yes. Okay. They, uh, again, that's kind of up to the judge, but we may work on that. But most of the time, not all the time. Um, for example, just by example, mm -hmm. I may talk to the officers about what's the basis for the OVI. And maybe I don't think there's enough there. And that's the most serious offense. That, without that, there's almost nothing here that, other than a payment of a fine for speeding or a seatbelt or something. Right. And, and then the other thing is the complication with you and the officers about getting out of the vehicle and Right, yeah, they, they did assault me and stuff, and well, I've got I'm it all saying, on video. I, I got that. I saw that, too. So there's all <laughs> things going back and forth. and But most of the time, you know, in the large scale of things, mm -hmm. it's not that significant. No, nothing and is. And I'm not, and I'm not going to agree to get extorted so, by any means. No, no, I'm not asking you to. You don't have to. That's one of the great things about our, just, our justice system. You don't right. have to. They can go in and prove it. They can talk about it. But sometimes, sometimes... There's a risk involved too. The judge decides against you, he has a problem. Sometimes you can just end up paying fines, going, okay, I'm going to be peaceably going on my way. I'll That's why I try to keep it as um, peacefully as right. possible. Right, everybody but, goes away, okay? You know, he has an oath of office to uphold too. I, listen, I'm not here to argue with you. <laughs> I wasn't even there. I'm just going to go, I, you 